Yo guys, what's going on? It's your boy Danny Mac back with another video. And today you guys can see I got my DS out on here. You know, it's my Pokeball 2DS. I love this freaking thing. Either way, um, we do have Black Version 2 loaded up as you guys can see right here. Now, this video is about the exploit that you guys may or may not have heard of that is going on with Gen 4, Gen 5 that was discovered. So shout out to Reddit for letting us know this information. I think that's the origin source. I'm not entirely sure. That is where I heard of it anyway, but either way, there is an exploit that lets you go on your Gen 4 games or Gen 5 games like Black 2 or Gold Silver, or Hard Gold Soul Silver, I mean, stuff like that, and allows you to go onto Nintendo Wi-Fi connection. Now, uh, what's the value of that, you may ask? Well, the cool thing is, it allows you to go on and get, um, you know, rare Pokemon that were given in events from way back in the day. So, for example, like on this game right here, I can actually, if I wanted to go into it, I could show you. I'll probably show some point in this video. The mons that I've gotten, like the shiny Giratina, shiny Palkia, shiny Dialga, um, and other stuff from like world's competition events, stuff that you wouldn't be able to get unless you were physically there in person, which is actually pretty cool to have. Um, it is going to ruin, in my opinion, some aspects of the event trading game, but... Either way, I'm here to show you guys because it will work on any regular DS. It's not a mod. It's not a hack. It's just using a DNS server that's still live as of this recording. So the first thing you're going to want to go to do is you're going to want to go over to your settings. You're going to want to go over to your system settings. You're going to want to go to internet settings. You're going to want to go to connection settings right here. And I do have some uh, connection settings already done. But you do want to be live on the internet. So make sure that's important. Make sure you have an actual internet connection. But you're going to want to go here to change settings. You're going to want to scroll over and go to your DNS. Now, this is the most important part. You want to have auto obtain DNS set to no. So it doesn't auto, you know, automatically get it. You want to go to detailed setup. And this is the number. I want to make sure you can see that clearly that you want to have for your primary DNS. That would be 164.132.044.106. Secondary DNS isn't as important. It will just be set to that. But that's the DNS you want to be have it set at. And then you're going to want to make sure. Now, this is something optional. This is just, I guess, how I had my settings. But in mine, I had to go to the IP address and actually go auto-obtain a IP address. Make sure that's turned on. So I got my IP address, but, you know, whatever. Um, and then you're going to want to get out of here once you're all set. You're going to want to make sure that you go on here and you test your connection and make sure that it actually works. So you guys can see we're getting access to the connection using the DNS server. So not bad. So now I'm going to go ahead and get on out of here and start up black two and show you how it works. Okay. So here we are, as you guys can see, I uh, got my game going on. I was fortuitously actually just replaying black two for fun. And when this exploit came out, so it was like the most serendipitous thing ever. But either way, you want to go over here. You want to go to mystery gift I'm gonna go ahead and click that. Then you're gonna go receive gift, open the open the channel for communication, get via Nintendo Wi-Fi connection. And of course, you're gonna connect to it, and it's gonna allow you to connect. And it should find you a mystery gift. Now, you're probably gonna get some duplicates a lot because it's just random. It's just really at random what kind of gift it gives you. It could be literally anything from the plethora of gifts that were given out in Gen 5. Um, like for example, right here, it's giving me Meloetta, even though I've already had it. See, I've already received this gift, and it says I've already received it, so it won't let me. But for example, let me just show you guys the card album to show you the kind of stuff I've gotten. I have deleted a bunch of them, but I did get the Shiny Giratina, I got the Mewtwo, and I got the Oxus with Nasty Plot, which was an event there too. But we're going to try again and see if it actually gives me a gift that I don't have. See how that works. We're going to go ahead and click that in. Shout out to my boy Shocker, by the way. I'm actually watching him stream Black Ops 4 right now. So, Shock, if you're watching this, shout out to you, bro. Make sure you go follow him on Twitch. And uh, I will leave his link down in the description below. So, this right here wants to give me uh, Metagross, the same one that I that I said that I got from Worlds earlier. Uh, I already have this one, so let's try it one more time. I'm just going to go ahead and cut until it gives me a mod that I don't have yet. Until then, I'll be right back. Okay, and here we actually have a new Pokemon that I don't have on this game yet. And this is Genesect. So, it's going to go ahead and give me Genesect. And you guys will see right here, hopefully we get it without a hitch. And there we go. We got the legendary Pokemon Genesect. So not bad at all. We're receiving the gift. Pick up your gift from the delivery man in the Pokemon Center. So it gives you that wonder card. And we did get this Genesect from, I don't even know when the event is. If you guys know, let me know in the comments down below, you know? 
but that's pretty much it guys that's going to be it you're going to be able to go into your game pick it up from the delivery man in the pokemon center and you have your legendary pokemon or event pokemon whatever you prefer to call it so either way guys thank you so much for watching this has been your boy danny mac just showing you a tutorial on how to use the dns exploit on gen 4 and 5 games so if you like this video make sure you give it a big thumbs up you can see in the screen and uh you know subscribe ring that bell and become part of the community thanks a lot for watching guys i'll see you all very soon peace friends